Hey guys, so I'm in Hilton, Malacca in Malaysia. I wanted to show you a couple of places here. I just had dinner, this is a gym. And so this is about, I believe it's about 28 floors. Uh, we are on uh, the 12th or the 13th floor. So you've got essentially what, what someday will be beachfront property, but now is essentially a really nice place to live. Uh, with respect to the hotel, um, it's obviously got a great gym, um, and not just a great gym, uh, but it's also got a, a sauna and a steam room. Uh, let me go ahead and show you the steam room and the sauna right after this. And these look like new machines. Uh, so that's fantastic. And just hit that little button, and then you go through. Nice little hallway there. What we're gonna see now will be the uh, sauna and the steam room. This is for women and for men. <laughs> oh, and it's locked. Looks like I, I didn't manage to get there in time. Um, but if you go inside, it's really nice. It's got a, um, just two different rooms. It's got everything that you would, ex you would expect uh, to be in a steam room and a sauna. Um, let's see, this is the kids club. And it's a nice place to have your kids hang out. A little bean bag over there. And we're gonna go through here. Oh, let's put the key card right here. I'm gonna go ahead and take this out right now. There we go. How are you doing? Sorry? Oh. Okay. I'm just gonna go. Okay. I'm gonna show people this one, and then I'm gonna head right back out. So this is the pool, and it's got a little bit of a view. This is the kids' pool. It's only uh, two feet, and they still have a no diving sign. What's really interesting is right, right back there, you can also see a little pool on the other side. Um, and that's basically a, uh, oh, let me show you the different rooms. So on the other side is, a, is what looks like to be a, a condo complex and the architecture is really nice. Over here, you've got a, here are the towels. You've got a, Italian restaurant. It's okay. Um, I just had dinner there. I probably won't be coming back. Um, we had a fixed price menu that was pretty much a disappointment. Um, the uh, the menu had some photos that just did not match uh, what we eventually uh, received. So just like every other big hotel, you've got you know your conference rooms and everything else. It looks like there's always a wedding going on oh i like this i like the design of these places that's really nice it kind of reminds me i know it's supposed to be chinese but it kind of reminds me of um new zealand for some reason so let's go ahead and go to the elevator that looks like the, the business center When I head up to the room. So this one will tell you that there's a mall. You'll see right here, there's a mall and a mall. The mall is at this point, basically a 7-Eleven and a lot of empty, empty stores. Um, there are a few places that sell clothing, but nothing you'd want to buy. Uh, so I don't know when the mall will actually open, but at this point, uh, the only useful things to you uh, will be the 7-Eleven that's going to be on as of March 2020, the 7-Eleven on the first floor. There's a couple of home furnishing um, places on the fourth and the third floor, but nothing that you'd probably want to buy if you're on vacation. Uh, and then there's a cinema on the 11th floor. Uh, that one's pretty nice. I would say that one's a nice one. Um, so basically, that's what's, what's going on there. 
Um, we're now on the 13th. I'm gonna head over to, let's see if I can make this thing work. So one of the problems here is that, that there, there are different hotels for the uh, rooms versus for the um, different hotel functions, because obviously you want people to be able to come up even if they're not um, hotel uh, guests, you, want, you still want them to be able to come up and, and go to your restaurants and, you know, just sort of partake in the different uh, activities and events they have. Let's see what here. So let me see if I can try to find the, the elevator. I know the elevator is here somewhere. So I might just end up, it's usually around the corner, actually. Let's see if I can try that. There we go. So I'm gonna head over to there. So I, um, as of today, I'm a gold member. And so I actually got an upgrade. The Hilton app is fantastic. You can, uh, usually the day of or the day before, you can just go ahead and check in and then figure this out. So we can go ahead and see what we have here. And And some of these rooms are a little bit different here because you've got, um, actually, so you've got some nice sort of, you know, postmodern art, um, but for the most part, you're looking at, uh, a similar situation. So this is the 17th floor. Let me try to show you what, and this is apparently, I think this is still, there's no executive lounge. Um, I should have mentioned that in the beginning. Um, so there's no executive lounge. Uh, so we're gonna go ahead and shake you up. Oops. You'll notice a Patronus um, emblem. Uh, that's those are the famous Patronus towers in uh, Kuala Lumpur, um, and of course that's the oil company. Uh, Malaysia has you know a lot of natural resources. It has oil, palm oil, which is used for cooking, um, and just a lot of other things. They make their own cars uh, called Proton. So they've tried to keep you know right now you've got Made in China um, as one of China's five to ten year plans. Uh, Malaysia's had that for the last 10 years. It's never quite trusted the relationship um, between, you know, within ASEAN between itself and Australia trying to shift a lot of the countries within Asia towards the West. And so under the uh, former Prime Minister Mahathir, Tun Mahathir, uh, Tun is, is a, a term of respect, like Mahatma, um, and a lot of people get that confused about Gandhi. They, they think it's, it's, that's his first name. It's not, I think it's Mohandas. Um, so anyway, this is the room, and I'll go ahead and quickly show you. Oh, what's going on here? Do not disturb. Uh-oh. Well, that's my room, so let's see what we got. And so we're going to go ahead and just show you different things here. That's the bed. So what I like about this place, it's very nice. The bathroom's huge, but again, this is an upgraded uh, facility. Uh, oh, look. So this, this is actually the shopping mall. So uh, once it's complete, it'll be a nice shopping mall, but as you can see, it's completely empty uh, at this point. And of course, you know, we've got a city view. And that's what we saw when we were we were at the poolside. So that's basically it. Um, this is the uh, Hilton Malacca in uh, Malaysia, and there's a TV as well.